Learning how to code is by far the best decision I ever made. Looking back now, I've been working as a developer for almost four years. I started learning how to code like almost like four and a half, five years ago. And it's pretty crazy to see like how far I've come and how programming has changed my life. And to just focus on it and really, really try to better my life with code was the best thing I ever did. I mean, I make more money than I've ever made in my entire life. I'm pretty close to six figures. I mean, I'm still off by, by, by a bit, but I've never in my life thought I would make what I'm making now. Like it's, it's pretty crazy to think how much money I make. And besides the money, right? The, the skills that you gain from, from learning how to code. If I wanted to, I could go into business for myself. I can start freelancing and pick up work and, and start my own digital agency. I could possibly even build my own applications and try to make money off of those. And it's honestly something that's on my list of things that I want to do this year or next year. I want to figure out a way to build some SaaS products and maybe some more blog websites and, and just find different ways to make money on the internet. Because now I realize that I have a lot of skills that can help me do those things. And it's all because of learning how to code, right? I would have never thought about spinning up a WordPress website and creating a blog had I not learned how to code, right? You hear a lot of people go in the blogging and whatnot. Like I, I heard about blogging before I learned how to code. But now since I've actually built a few blogs before for clients and for myself, I know that I can do it and I know how I can make money off of that. But if it wasn't for learning how to code, I would have never tried to learn WordPress and I would have never realized how easy it was to do it and to get into that kind of line of work. If it wasn't for learning how to code, I would have never realized that I could like move anywhere I want and get this super in demand job that's really changed my life. That has, that, that it's taken me in a path that I never would have thought. Because before this, my future would have probably been working at a restaurant and maybe becoming a manager. And there's nothing wrong with that. I know a lot of people who took that path and make really good money. It's not what I wanted to do, though. And I'm not trying to, you know, down talk anyone who goes that route. If it wasn't for learning how to code, I probably would have looked into becoming an electrician or maybe a plumber or some trade skill that would have made me decent money, maybe HVAC. There's a lot of career paths that can make you good money. And then a lot of those career paths can also set you up for opening up your own business. You know, many, many plumbers or electricians that go into it for themselves end up doing well, or they can work a job and get paid nicely. And the same goes for, for programming, right? But had I not decided to start doing it and I, had I not done it, I wouldn't have realized how, how beneficial it was for me. And now after doing it for a few years, like I got recruiters that call me all the time and I know that I can get a job fairly easily, especially now that I'm at that sweet spot where I've got like the right amount of experience and it's a lot easier to get hired after you got like three or four years of experience. I know that, that I'm, I'm marketable. I know that I can, I can easily get a six figure job. I, I, for, for a fact, and I'm not trying to like humble brag. I'm just trying to tell you out there. And I, I, I want to give a, a shout out to coding phase because I remember when I was learning how to code uh, years ago and I was watching his channel. I really related to the dude because it, he felt like he came from like a very similar background as I did. And, and he was one of the people that I could relate to more on YouTube. And he said something that it was like, I will never make any less money than what I'm making right now. And now after doing this for a while, I realized what he was trying to say at that point. I realized it, that it's very true. I right now will never make any less money than what I'm making right now, unless I decide to go into business for myself. And then it's only a matter of time until I make more money than what I'm making now, or I just go back to working a software developer job if I fail at my own business because I'm already highly marketable in a very desirable like field. And it's weird to think that way, but I kind of want to make you guys out there think that way too 
because learning how to code goes beyond just getting a job. It, it literally will change your life and it changed my life for the better. And, and it, again, it's the smartest, best decision I've ever made. And I'm so glad I did it. And if you're watching my channel now and you're struggling through it and you're just kind of not feeling it or thinking that it's not going to be possible and you're getting stuck on stuff and you're just having a hard time and, and you feel dumb and you feel like you can't do it. I felt all those things. I went through it just like you're going through it right now. But me, after four years of doing this now, I am very, very happy that I decided to learn how to code. I am very happy that I stuck with it and that I don't realize like how far I've come. And, and when I do take a step back and I do look at it and I see how far I've come, all I can say is that I'm so happy that I've come this far. And then I think about how far I'm going to be going in the next few years and, and everything I'm going to learn and, and how valuable it has been for me and how, how great it is for my life and for my kids and my family and, and how I'm able to provide for them. And like, I'm living like nice middle-class life with the white picket fence and, and the, and the minivan and all the things that, that a lot of people wish that they had. And, you know, although I worked really, really hard for it, sometimes I don't appreciate it as much because I, I don't, I don't see it because I've kind of gotten used to it. But when I look back at how, I grew up and I think about like when I was like 15 years old and 16 years old and the kind of life I lived and I look now like I don't even feel like I'm the same person. I don't even feel like this is my life sometimes because it's so weird to think that that I'm a software developer and I work a really good job and I make really good money and I have a very comfortable life and even not even 15 years old like if I look back to 20 like when I was 25 if I look back 10 years right because 15 would be like 20 years if I look back 10 years if I look back five years right before I started learning how to code I had no idea that I would be here like the the amount of money that I'm making compared to what I was making five years ago the kind of life that I'm living the 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 comfort the the security that I have the pension and the the money in my savings and the health insurance and all those really nice things that I that I have, I wouldn't have believed I, I, I would be here five years ago. And it's really been just about that long since I've learned how to code, actually less than five years. And and it's it's cool. It's really cool. So if you're trying to better your life, if coding is the thing that you think is going to do it for you, just keep at it. Keep at it. You won't regret it. You will regret not doing it though. You will regret if you try it for like three months and give it up, unless you don't like it, then don't do it. Like don't do anything you don't like. But if you like it, but you just kind of give up because of whatever reasons and you just don't feel like you can do it and and you, you decide to just pick something else up, you might look back and wish that you'd done it because I look now and I think about if I wouldn't have continued to do it and I wouldn't have got to where I'm at now, I mean, I wouldn't have known, but I, if I knew where I could have been and I, and I hadn't done it, I would have been very upset. If that makes any sense. Cause that sounded really confusing when I said it. And now listening to what I said, I confused myself. I hope I'm not confusing you, but what I'm trying to say is that I'm very happy that I did it. It changed my life forever for the best. And if you're trying to learn how to code and you want to better your life, Trust me, you won't regret it. It was the best decision I ever made. And you probably will feel the same way once you're making really good money, working a really nice job with all the perks and benefits of, of working a good job. You'll probably feel the same way I'm feeling right now. And I wanted to make a positive video because I was making all those negative videos and people were just like, what's wrong with you, dude? You're like supposed to be the guy that's all positive and you're talking about all these bad things about being a programmer. Well, at the end of the day, it's a job. And if you don't like it, you're not going to like it. And there's a lot of things about this job that aren't all rainbows and butterflies. And that's the truth. But that's the truth with any job. So pick your poison. Figure out what you want in a job. And if being a software developer marks all those check boxes for the things that you're looking for, then go for it, right? Because like I said, I probably would have been a plumber or an electrician or some other trade had I not gone into coding. And I'm glad I did. With all that said, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, 
Make sure to hit that like button. If you have any suggestions on other videos that you want me to make or anything else that you want me to talk about, make sure to drop a comment down below. If you're learning how to code and you're feeling like it's gonna be the biggest change in your life and the best thing that you're gonna do and you're really looking forward to getting that first job, also let me know in the comments because I'm, I'm happy to, to hear what people are working on and, and what their goals are for learning how to code. Um, with all that said, thanks for watching and see you next time.